made it to Hanoi. We leave tomorrow to go to a tour of Halong Bay. Our cruise will be gone for three days. Um, so we're only in this hotel for one night, but it was really nice. They upgraded our room from a no window to a window room, so that's cool. And yeah, we'll see how our tour goes tomorrow. Flight from Fukui to here was good. And now we're just hungry, so we're gonna go get some pho. It's cold here, so yay, because it's been really hot everywhere we've been since New Zealand. And Seamus is already eating the complimentary fruit because he's all hungry. I'm hungry. He's hungry. We just got to the dock in Halong Bay and we board in an hour. Um, we're doing a three day, two night cruise with like a day trip somewhere in there. There's like kayaking and I don't know what else. Um, but we paid for a luxury cruise, so hopefully it's luxury. <laughs> Cause actually we paid a decent amount compared to other cruises that we could have taken but we didn't want to do a budget one um, we didn't want to do any like shady ones we paid extra for a balcony so I wanted the balcony the balcony was a must for me uh, if anything happens on the boat at night we can just jump overboard <laughs> that's like a serious thought <laughs> so um, hopefully it's nice and after the cruise, we head back to Hanoi for a couple of days. So, I'll keep you guys updated and bring you along because I haven't been vlogging very much. These are all bio boats. We're getting ready to board. We're up on top. That champagne better be complimentary. <laughs> oh, look, blue clogs. Wow, shame. Look at that. Yeah, it's like a legit balcony. <laughs> oh, and we have like loungers? Yeah. Apparently the extra 200 bucks was worth it. <laughs> we definitely paid a pretty penny for this tour though. So hopefully it's good. The room seems really nice though, so that's a plus. And we're off.
caves, but I didn't bring my camera, so cell phone vlog it is. Are you gonna get in? Uh, I'll probably swim. He said, I don't know if I'm gonna swim. We just got back from kayaking and we went to a cave and we touched the water, I got into like my knees, but we didn't actually get in. It was kind of muddy. But now we're gonna break into our complimentary champagne. Don't break anything. Huh? Huh? Oh! You want enough? Champagne. We're gonna drink sh some champagne, go lay out on the deck. Look at the gorgeous view. Dinner's not for a few hours, so we're gonna enjoy the night. Cheers. Cheers. We made it back to our room. We just ate dinner, and you can go squid fish off of the back of the boat. So we're gonna go try that right now before we go to bed. It's like 8.40 right now? It's super late. For us. <laughs> well, for us, definitely. Um, but we still gotta, like, shower and stuff, so... Tomorrow we get to sleep in till, like, 8. No, like, breakfast is 7 to 8, so we gotta eat oh, breakfast yeah. at 7.30. And then we're going onto a different boat for the day, and we're gonna go to a floating village and do some other stuff, kayak a bunch, so... It should be an eventful day.
it's our last day in Halong Bay. It's super early right now. It's like 6.30. And there's one. And we're doing our last activity for the day, which is going to the biggest cave in Halong Bay. And um, we came out on the balcony and there's a bunch of birds flying around really close. Seamus is trying to get some photos. And then we leave to go to the cave in like half an hour. We have to pack. And then we come back to the boat and have brunch. And then we pack up and go home. So I'll take you guys with me. The cave's supposed to be cool. So we'll see. But the views are pretty nice. They've been like this kind of the whole time. So nothing new, but still pretty magical. Shame has to duck his head, but I don't. <laughs> Walk around the corner and there's just more of the cave, like a lot that you couldn't see when you first walked in. 